Good morning from Quartzsite, Arizona. I can't tell you how good it feels to be standing out here in the sunshine. We have had two days straight of wind. We're talking like 40 mile per hour gusts of wind and rain. And it is calm today and beautiful and sunny and we're really excited for what we have planned. So let's go. great time out here at the desert bar and I wanted to take the opportunity to introduce and I wanted to take the opportunity to introduce Janelle and Mark we rode out here with them and they're our neighbors at Convergence right now and also YouTube <laughs> not followers absolutely <laughs> yeah, yeah yep we've been chatting online for a while before Convergence so it's fun to get to meet in person and hang out for the day and we're gonna go see uh, what other kind of trouble we can stir up <laughs> All right, guys, we are back at camp. Uh, some of you asked questions about our time lapses, and I thought I would just take a quick minute to let you know how I do the time lapses. I do want to say that there are many ways of doing them, and I'm by no means, if not the furthest thing, from an expert on cameras and whatnot. But all I do is I find a spot where there's something moving. You have to have movement, whether it's humans, sun, clouds, something moving and then I zoom the camera in adjust all the angles and try to frame a nice shot then all I do is hit record and let that thing run for 7 to 15 minutes then at the end of the day I pull the footage off the card I put it into my editing software Premiere Pro trim the ends you know where you set the camera down and then when you pick it up and then speed it up to uh, I think my program maxes out at 10,000 speed so every program may be a little different but the big thing you want to remember is make sure there's something moving because for example if i do a time lapse right here you know there's a few faint clouds right there but it's not really going to show up as anything impressive on the camera now over here to the south there are some clouds and just for the sake of this video i'm going to uh set up a time lapse right now capture some footage and throw it in and <laughs> 